I'm Paya from the Santa Barbara Middle School Team Press, and today I'm here with... I'm uh, Matt Edwards. And I'm Jordan Barrow. Thank you, and congratulations on your award. Thank you. Um, how did you find the story, and what inspired you to direct Our Worlds Collide? Do you want to take that first? Yeah, I mean, uh, we were fortunate enough to meet the, the organization Get Lit uh, in 2018, and immediately we felt we met these young people that were all 15 to 18 years old and were so insightful and connected and, and passionate about um, so many causes that I think we were just really impressed and felt like we don't get to see enough stories about young people who are doing incredible things um, and that are so smart well beyond their years. And so I think we felt we really connected with that idea and connected with the poetry that they were producing as well and, and blown away from that as an artistic endeavor as well. And so I think we immediately wanted to see where we could take that and, and a film was sort of the natural progression of that and we're so uh, blessed to have found this world and feel like we just want hopefully for people to have that same sense of discovery um, when they get to see the film. Thank you. Um, did watching these high schoolers write poetry inspire you to write poetry of your own? Oh, you have to take that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, fun fact, my, uh, I hadn't writ written much poetry. I'd studied it in school, um, but for my Christmas gift to my partner, uh, this last year I wrote her a poem, um, which was very well received. Uh, and uh, yes, yeah, so it's definitely uh, inspired. And I think it's, it, I think you, if you want to work with poets, it's helpful to write something because it shows the commitment, the courage, the strength to sort of verbalize your thoughts and feelings. Um, and I think writing that was uh, A, really special to share with someone that I care about, but also B, to experience what it's like to actually be a poet um, even in that short experience, in that short burst. And that, uh, that, that poem is now f framed in his house. It's, yeah. It's really beautiful. Yeah. Um, so we heard that you worked with famous musicians. How is that different from working with uh, these young poets? Um, it's, it's similar and different in a lot of ways. Um, when you're working with high profile artists, uh, you're working with a big team, you're on tours, uh, you're in the music studios, and I feel that it's not as personal as working one on one with each of these poets. They are equally as talented and write beautiful, you know, as equally beautiful words. Um, but I would say that, and that was one of the things that we found through the process of making this, and that's why it was so gratifying to make this film is that um, we, they were just so honest and open and giving with their stories and their words and um, yeah, we, it, was, it was incredible. Thank you. Um, what would you say to young poets who um, don't live in places that have the Get Lit program? Um, all I would say is that, I mean, Get Lit has outreaches now all over the world, but honestly, no matter where you are in the world, you have access to internet, you have access to YouTube. I would just say keep going, keep writing. And it's like they say in the music industry, you know, like if you write a hit, everyone will, everyone will hear it. So uh, yeah. if you write something that people resonate with, it's, um, they're going to listen to it, they're going to seek it out, they're going to hear it. So my advice would just be keep going. Thank you. I'd say as well, talk with your friends. I think it's the thing that is amazing about these poets is they're all connected as friends as well. And I think um, when you're going through struggles, when you're going through tough things, talking about it is the first step. And I think you'd be surprised with so many times I think we all think, oh, no one knows how I feel. And I, I think once you start talking about it, you realize, oh, wow, a lot of people do. And I think then when you turn that into art, that can even make more of an impact for more people. If you were to give me one homework assignment, what would it be and why? I'm going to steal this one because <laughs> someone asked us this question last night and Rosario Dawson, who is our incredible executive producer, said you should watch the film Our Words Collide. So uh, that is, uh, that, it was a great answer from her <laughs> that I'm stealing. <laughs> uh, do you have a favorite poet? Honestly, I have five and they're the ones that start in our film, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> Same. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Awesome. You're great. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thank you. Yeah.